Welcome to the Elevator World News Podcast. This week's news podcast is sponsored by the Elevator Agency. Is your business missing the mark when it comes to your promotional and marketing materials? Elevator World's 64 years of publishing experience in the vertical transportation industry can produce a focused marketing campaign aimed at scoring you more business. The Elevator Agency can assist you with essential business materials, product catalogs, as well as marketing and advertising needs. For a free quote, contact agency at elevatorworld.com. This is your daily industry news update for June 6, 2017. In today's news, Hitachi's world's fastest elevator achieves 1,260 meters per minute. A fierce debate over skyscrapers in Bulgaria is taking place. And Paris' La Defense District could have a new tallest structure. Hitachi Limited announced on June 2nd its world's fastest elevator in the Guangzhou CTF Finance Center in China achieved a speed of 1,260 meters per minute compared with its rated speed of 1,200 meters per minute reached in May 2016. The new speed was recorded by public accreditation body, the National Elevator Quality Supervision and Inspection Center, and will be used for future product development. When it goes into service, the elevator will run at its rated speed. Hitachi observed the feat was achieved thanks in part to advanced drive and control technology, compact traction machine with stronger, tighter ropes, and a single governor corresponding with different rated speeds for ascending and descending. Balkan Insight reports new and proposed skyscrapers in the city center of Sofia, the capital of Bulgaria, are sparking fierce debate over the structure's suitability for their surroundings. Opponents contend the buildings mar the city's appearance and are being moved forward with little to no oversight. After two striking skyscrapers, Capitol Fort and Sky Fort, rose at the city's entrance, several additional projects have been proposed. The most controversial of these is the 215-meter-tall, 55-story Paradise Tower, a Russian-Georgian development approved by the local government in April. Contending the project is illegal, more than 4,300 people have signed a petition against it. Skyrise Cities reports in 2021, Paris's La Defense Business District could have a new tallest structure in the form of the Link, 51 and 34-story office towers linked by 30 stories of elaborate sky gardens with workspace and amenities. One of three sites being considered by gas giant Total SA, the link was designed by PCA Stream and would be developed by Groupama and Mobilier. Its most remarkable feature is the series of sky gardens, each at 8 meters wide with terraces and hanging gardens, interspersed with features such as a fitness center, business center, and restaurants. The link would replace three mid-rise buildings built in the 1980s. For more industry-related information, visit elevatorworld.com and be sure to subscribe to our podcast in iTunes or the Google Play Store. If you're interested in becoming a sponsor of the Elevator World News Podcast, just let us know by emailing advertising at elevatorworld.com.